Stress is something we all experience, but did you know that it can also affect your kidneys? We will discuss the connection between stress and kidney health, as well as provide you with some valuable tips for managing stress effectively and improving your kidney's health. So let's dive in. Welcome back to the Kidney Zone. I am Dr. Mo. To begin, let's understand how stress can affect our kidneys and why it's important to manage it. So, what is the connection between stress and kidney health? Our kidneys play a vital role in maintaining overall health by filtering waste and excess fluids from our blood. However, prolonged or chronic stress can have a negative impact on our kidneys in several ways. Number one, increase blood pressure. Because stress triggers the release of stress hormones such as cortisol which can lead to elevating the blood pressure and the high blood pressure can strain the blood vessels in our kidneys and potentially causing damage over time. Number two is reduce blood flow. Because chronic stress can cause blood vessels to constrict and become smaller which will reduce the blood flow to the kidneys and this can compromise the ability of the kidneys to function as they should. Number three is inflammation. Because inflammation, uh, which is caused by stress, can activate inflammatory responses and generate uh, free radicals, and both of which can contribute to the kidney damage. Number four is that stress can cause you to drink less water, and this can cause dehydration and can damage your kidneys. Number five, under stress, some individuals, some people can consume excessive amounts of sugar especially in the form of energy drinks or processed food. This can contribute to the development of kidney disease. High sugar intake can lead to obesity and diabetes, and high blood pressure, uh, which is also caused by the energy drinks, all of this can increase the risk of kidney damage. Now that we understand how stress can impact our kidneys, let's discuss more uh, of the effective strategies for managing uh, the stress and promoting good kidney health. Number one is practice relaxation techniques. Engaging in relaxation techniques can help reduce the stress levels and promote overall well-being. So consider incorporating activities such as deep breathing, exercise, and meditations, yoga, or even tai chi to your daily routines. Number two, get regular exercise. Because physical activity is a fantastic way to combat stress. Regular exercise releases endorphins, and these are pretty much our body's natural mode elevators. They help reduce the stress levels and make us feel better. So aim for at least 30 minutes of moderate exercise most days of the week. Number three, take care of yourself. Because taking care of yourself is very important when it comes to stress management. Make time for activities that bring you joy and relaxation, such as reading or taking showers, spending time in nature, or pursuing hobbies that you like. Don't forget to get enough sleep as well, because maintaining a good sleep is uh, effective in managing stress. Also eat a balanced diet. Number four, which is also very important, is seeking support. It's very important to reach out for support when stress becomes overwhelming or even talk to your mental health professional which can provide guidance and give empathetic ear which can help you feel better. Number five, practice time management. Poor time management can contribute to stress. So plan your day effectively, make sure your tasks are organized and allocate time for breaks and self-care activities. And remember, it's okay to say no uh, to feel better. So here you are. Stress can indeed affect our kidneys, but with the right stress management techniques, we can safeguard our kidney health and improve our, our overall well-being. Remember, it's essential to listen to your body. Be mindful to your stress levels and take proactive steps to manage stress effectively. By doing so, you're not only benefiting your kidneys, but also enhancing your overall quality of life. If you found this episode to be helpful, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and share it with others who might benefit from these stress management tips. As always, take care of yourself, prioritize your health, 
and we'll see you in the next episode of Tekenizo.